My name is Brian Hanna, I chair Newcastle New Deal for Communities, which is now known as Centre West. We're in the final year of a 10 year programme, which we had about £54 million of government money to spend across six themes. Um, Newcastle NDC have been pretty successful as we're the only NDC to actually hit the targets across all themes. We're also the, um, the highest um, rate of organisation for drawing match funding in. We've drawn in around £125 million on top of the money we've already had. Um, how we're going to continue is we've got an asset strategy in place where we ring fenced £5 million. We've all, already got four buildings which the surpluses go back for to help run the organisation. We've got a bid in for another one and we've also got um, a rather large project which we will come to fruition in the summer of 2011 which is we've taken over the old west where well, we've won the old west road fire station site which is approximately 1.3 acres um, we're going to turn it into probably the best way it is it's not so much community use it's community benefit um, there's a real mixture and across the uh, organ across the site um, the main building is about 35,000 square feet the ground floor will contain a restaurant and bistro Voluntary sector area, a crash, an enterprise area, and a reception which will also double as a social enterprise itself because it will run a virtual office from that area. The middle floor will contain about 10,000 square foot of serviced office space as well as meeting pods. There will be a large multi use, multi function celebration conference area which can take up to 500 people on the top floor. Um, that will cover, that, that's going to be aimed at everybody, both commerce and community. We do think we've got a market for the Asian wedding market as we have a large, quite a sizable Asian community that live in the area and at the moment they're having to move out of the area to do any sort of celebration on any, any, any large scale. Um, externally away from the main building we have two, two wings of training rooms which we're now looking at expand, expanding before we even got to the planning stage, um, an artisan's mall, some workshops and a radio station all of which we also believe will be environmentally sustainable. We're aiming for an environment, uh, a, ne a carbon negative building. Um, so our aim is also to produce enough, enough power to sell back to the grid.